Hello and welcome to another video. Today I will install and compare two CPU coolers. Modern CPUs usually run hot and require proper cooling. So today we will test the Corsair H60 water cooler and the Noctua U14S, which is an air cooler. Note that this video is not sponsored by any company and I've paid for all the products you see here with my own money. We will run a fair stress test to see which cooler will do a better job. The CPU I am using here is the i7-9700K that will be pushed to the max. If you want to jump to the test result, they are at the 1 minute and 23 second mark for the H60 and 8 minutes mark for the Noctua. The room temperature is at 24 degrees Celsius or 75 Fahrenheit and I am using Corsair 750D computer case. The H60 is running around 30 degrees idle, which is good. Let's see if we stress it a little bit with IDA64. We're gonna run it for 10 minutes, but I will fast forward. As you can see here, running cores at 100%, we reached 76 degrees, which is still acceptable. Now let's stress the CPU even more by rendering 4K videos. As you can see, temps are creeping up fast. Now it's in the 80s. We reached 96 degrees. So I'm gonna stop the test here. It's too hot. So obviously the H60 is not enough for this hot chip. Let's try the Noctua 14S. Again, if you want to jump to the test results directly, click on the 8 minute mark. But for now, give me some time to install the fan.
as we can see here the 4s is running at 28 degrees at idle so 2 degrees less than the H60 let's see the IDA stress test After 10 minutes, the maximum temperature reached 67 Celsius. That's a full 9 degrees cooler than the H60. That's very good. Let's go to the final test, the 4K video rendering. The max temp here is at 86. I think that is acceptable under extreme stress conditions. Your CPU should never reach 90 degrees. So the Noctua 14S is the clear winner here. It ran 10 degrees cooler in this test. I will add a link in the description below to both coolers if you are interested in buying them. I hope you enjoyed this video, if you have any question or comment feel free to add them below, take care.